いらっしゃいませありがとうございましたマジマジそんなに怒ってんのこの間の事件の時に。But 18 years ago, a, a family had their office here. The Arakawa family? Don't you know what I'm talking about? A、uh, family? Not a family, family. A, a Yakuza office, okay? Anyway, I know it was here.、Uh, that's too far back even for my old bones. <laughs> But I'll be honest with you, I don't see how the Arakawa family could have been holed up in a dinky office like this. Oh, so you do know them? I don't think there's a soul on this side of town who does it. They're a huge, famous family. Really? Finally, some good news. So, where are they? I'm looking for them. Ah, <sighs> not sure. In this day and age, Yakuza can't exactly be loud and proud, you know. Especially not hot shots like the Arakawa boys. I get it. Okay, thanks. Think you'll find them? Yeah. Well, I'll just ask the old woman at the SIG stand where they're headquartered. She always knows what's going on. Okay, good luck. Where's the old woman? Oh, you mean the previous owner? <laughs> She moved back to the countryside a long time ago. Probably taking it easy in an old folks' home by now. Oh, I see.、Uh, hey, do you know where the Arakawa family office is? If, if you're not making a purchase, I should help the customer behind you. I just want to know where the Arakawa office is. Hey, some of us got places to be. Give me the usual. Yes, here you are. 500 yen, please. Just put it on my tab. Wow. People sure have gotten rude since I was gone. How pathetic. You say something? Where'd you learn your manners, huh? Mom raised you in a barn? Oh, jeez. And you're walking around town wearing a Tojo badge? Oh, wait. It's Omi Alliance. So, you're in the know. What family are you from? Me? I'm Arakawa. Oh,、uh, nice to meet you, brother. Sorry I didn't know you. I'm new. Like hell you are. You're lying out here with the only symbols, faking like you're Arakawa. Wait. 
you and that crew that visited the old chairman's grave today? Hmm? Oh, yeah, there was a big ceremony scheduled. But only the Patriarch and his officers go to stuff like that. Maybe some of their assistants, too, but that's it. Damn, you must be newer than me. Tell me one thing. Who's our Patriarch right now? Dude, you living under a rock? Just tell me who it is. It's acting captain of the Omi Alliance, Masumi Arakawa, obviously. Man, you forgot the name of your Patriarch? Get your shit together. Hey, you don't order me to do anything. I'm not Omi. Oh, but you just said you were in the Arakawa family. Damn right. And that family is part of the Tojo clan. Tojo clan? You sleep talking, dude? Do I look fucking asleep? No, you don't. You must be one of those Tojo pests still crawling around. We've got permission from HQ to exterminate them on sight. You Omi are the ones who invaded. This city is Tojo turf. Not anymore. And you Tojo roaches need to die already. Let's do it. Cool. Kawasan really betray the Tojo clan and run to the Yomi? Answer me! Yes! Aniki! That guy's a Tojo loyalist! Get him! What? Get back here! Excuse me.
Thanks. <sighs> See ya. up. Help your... <laughs> 
Strong. We're gonna remember your face, dick! I can tell you love your job, but you ought to love being alive more. Else who's gonna take care of that precious camera? A real fist fight between the Omi Alliance and a Tojo clan loyalist! <laughs> oh yeah, these picks will go for a fortune! <laughs> Thanks, Ichiban. Hey, hold up! that guy it was your fault anyway come on get out of here if I see you again I'm gonna beat the shit out of you tough words for a guy who just took off screaming yeah you better run Kamulop Kamulop it's a local mascot they made to improve Kamurocho's image what the hell is a local mascot <sighs> We're gonna be here all day. Remember the internet? It's big now. Use it. Fine. Just tell me what happened to the Arakawa family. And Arakawa-san. You were in that family once upon a time, right? Stop! You gotta know what happened, being a local reporter. I don't believe that Arakawa-san was a traitor. It wasn't who he was! You really wanna know why Arakawa did what he did? Because I do have the scoop. I'm not a journalist for nothing. So tell me! When did you get locked up again? 18 years ago. And Arakawa had a son, right? Yeah, the young master. It used to be my job to escort him. I don't know the details, but he was kind of sickly, right? Uh-huh. But what do you mean, was? Is he better now? He's dead. What? When? How? Hmm. Would have been about three years after you went into the slammer. As I recall, his condition got worse. There was nothing they could do. Arakawa was pretty fond of him, or so I assume. It was more than being fond of him. Arakawa-san would have died for his son. Maybe the loss changed his perspective on things. Nothing worse than burying your own kid. Yeah. I can't imagine how that must have felt, but... I still don't see how that would make him betray the Tojo clan. You don't. Maybe you can't understand, but once you have a child, the rest of your life is over. The kid becomes your life's purpose, you know? So imagine the grief you'd feel if the kid dies. You just keep existing with your life's purpose pulled out from under you. The parents gotta find another reason, any other reason, to keep living. Couple that with the fact that Arakawa is a Yakuza. I think maybe his new reason to live became... watching the world burn. He wouldn't. Hey, why don't you give me some info now? You really in trouble with the Omi like those thugs said? Yeah. Then you shouldn't just be strolling around Kamurocho. You still got business here? If not... I'd get out of town. Huh? I promise, Kasuga! There's nothing left for you in Kamrocho! But... Then where would I go? I mean... I don't know, dude. I'm just saying the Omi are looking for you. So I'd get out of town if I were you. Don't go home. Home? Yeah, the soap land you were born in? That'd be your home, right? Shangri-La. Hey! You're not going there now, are you? Don't do it! I'm telling you, they'll kill you! Kill me? <laughs> Let him try. <laughs> 